after we posted our top bidet seats of 2022 and the Eco Nova came in third place, we got a lot of feedback with customers asking for us to compare specifically the Eco Nova to the BioBidet BB2000. So today we're going to compare and contrast the pros and the cons of both of these seats so that you can figure out which of these seats is the perfect fit for you. My name is Daniel Johnson, I'm your bidet expert, and I'm the owner of ManyBidets.com, where we've sold thousands of BB2000s, and we're on our way to do the same for the Eco Nova. So let's go ahead and start by talking about the look and the feel of both of these units. First of all, let's look at the Eco Nova. The Eco Nova has a sleek, classy profile. It looks more like a traditional toilet seat than practically any other seat on the market because of how sleek it is. The BB2000, on the other hand, has a taller back and it has the silver accent strip. So if you like the silver accent strip, if it fits your bathroom's decor, awesome. Otherwise, the Eco Nova might fit your bathroom decor a little bit better because of how sleek it is. Now the cord placement on both of these units is a little bit different as well. So you can see that the Eco Nova has the cord placement and the water placement both on the same side, the left-hand side when facing the toilet. Whereas the BB2000 has the water on the left, but the cord on the right. So they are a little bit different in that respect. It's also important to note that the Eco Nova comes in elongated only, whereas the BB2000 offers both an elongated and a round option. So if you have a round toilet, the BB2000 is probably the better option out of the two. So now that we've talked about the look and feel of the seats, let's talk about the look and feel of the remotes. The BB2000 comes with two different remotes, a white or a black, your choice at purchase, and is made out of a hard plastic with raised rubber buttons. It also has a screen that has countdowns on it, lets you see what's being selected, and uses an infrared signal. On the other end, we have the Eco Nova remote. One style, that's it. It's a stainless steel with a rose gold finish, and it uses a radio frequency. There's no screen, but you do have LED indicators at the top letting you know what's been selected. And there are words on the buttons instead of logos so that you know exactly what you're pressing. So either of these two remotes may be the remote for you, depending on what you're looking for. For the BB2000, if you like the little logos and icons, and you like having a screen that shows you exactly what's happening when you're running your wash, the BB2000 remote is a great option. However, if you like the words on a remote so that you know exactly what you're pressing, and maybe like the texture of the stainless steel, the Eco Nova remote might be a better option for you. Let's talk a little bit more about the radio frequency remote the Eco Nova offers and the infrared remote that the BB2000 offers. This is another key thing that you need to keep in mind when picking a remote. Radio frequency means that the bidet seat can be operated from outside the bathroom. It also means that if there's dark walls or a small space, there's still going to be no issue with the signal from the remote making it to the seat. However, with the BB2000, just like most other bidet seats on the market, it uses infrared. The infrared signal can be blocked by things like dark walls or a small bathroom. So you might have harder times with the remote signal making it to the seat. Because both of these seats offer self-cleaning, there is a delay from pressing the button to run a wash and having the wash kick in. With the Eco Nova, we saw this average out at about seven seconds, and we saw the BB2000 at about six. Now, both of these remotes are a little bit different from the wall mount standpoint as well. The Eco Nova's wall mount holds it away from the wall a little bit and has a little bit of give. So it's a little bit trickier to operate it while it's sitting in the wall mount, but it is doable, but it is also easier to pull in and out of the wall mount. The BB2000, on the other hand, has a very tight wall mount, so operating the remote while it's on the wall is very, very quick and easy. However, taking it out of the wall mount to operate it in hand is going to acquire a little bit more effort. Both of these seats also offer a beeping function, which allows you to know that the seat is responding to the remote. With the Eco Nova, that feature is on period, whereas with the BB2000, you can turn it off if you want. While we're talking about noises, let's talk about the loudness of the wash. With the BB2000, it's going to be much louder than you're going to have with the Eco Nova. However, both the Eco Nova and the BB2000 are going to have 
quieter washes at lower pressure and louder washes as you go up the pressure chain because the higher pressure means more work for the pump. As we wrap up look and feel, let's talk about comfort. Customers of ours who have tried both the BB2000 and the Econova, hands down, like the comfort of the Econova better. Now, a lot of people will ask before buying, what about the whole size of the seat? Well, it's important to note that the whole size of any bidet seat is about the same. They're very, very similar, but the whole size is not what dictates comfort. As you can see, the slope off of the BB2000 is very steep because there's a lot of hardware in the back, while the Eco Nova is much more compact in the back. So while the size of the hole is very similar, you get a lot more sitable space here because you can sit further back versus the BB2000 where that slope can interfere with being able to sit as far back. So when thinking about comfort on a bidet seat, there's a lot more to it than the size of the hole where most bidet seats have a very similar hole size. A lot of bidet seats on the market today have plastic nozzles versus both of these which have stainless steel. This helps to eliminate bacteria buildup, but while they have that in common, they also have a lot of differences. The BB2000 has three spouts built into the tip. Each of those spouts is a single hole and will offer you a rear wash, a front wash, and an enema wash. Whereas the Eco Nova has front and rear, and both of those spouts have multiple holes to spread out the wash a little bit and offer a more gentle wash versus the BB2000, which has a more powerful wash. While both of these units have stainless steel nozzles, the BB2000 stainless steel nozzle has a plastic tip. This tip is removable, which makes for easy cleaning, but the plastic is not as sterile as the stainless steel, and if you don't twist the tip all the way back on, you're gonna have a stream that shoots off center until you adjust it. While the BB2000 does not have any sterilization functionality, the Eco Nova offers both silver nano sterilization and UV sterilization, so it's a very sterile unit. If a bidet seat is going to do its job, it has to hit the target. One of the limitations of a bidet seat is how far the nozzle can reach, and because of that, whether or not it hits the target it's aimed for. If you run into a scenario where it's not, you might have to scoot a little bit further backwards in order to get a good wash. Now that being said, different nozzles have different reaches, and we did some testing to find out exactly how far the nozzles for both of these units reach. When doing our testing, we measured from the front of the bowl to where the water would come in contact with the individual using the bidet. For the Eco Nova, for the rear wash, you're looking at eight inches from the front to contact point. With the front wash, you're looking at seven and a half inches from the front of the bowl to the contact point. With the BB2000, you're looking at about nine inches from the front of the bowl to the contact point for the rear wash, and for the front wash, it's eight and a half inches. Both of these seats do have adjustable nozzle positions, so those measurements are the furthest forward settings on both of these units, but they can adjust to about an inch further back as well, should you need to adjust them further back. As you might expect from a high-end seat, both of these offer great comfort and great wash settings. Both of them offer unlimited warm water from the very start to the very end of the wash. The Eco Nova also offers a pulsating wash or a sits bath, which is a alternating cold and hot stream. Whereas the BB2000 offers a pulsating wash and that pulsating wash is pulsating between hard and soft water pressures. Both of them also offer nozzle oscillation where it moves back and forth so that you're covering a wider range from front to back. The Eco Nova also offers what they call a turbo wash, but is really just the, the hardest setting in the set of three settings from low to high. The BB2000 offers an enema wash, which is a unique wash that pushes water through the nozzle with hard pressure through the thinnest of the nozzle spouts in the nozzle. Neither of these offer user presets. If you're looking for a unit with user presets, our top seats are going to be the Toto S550e, Toto S500, and the Swash 1400. If you want a comparison between either of these two seats and either of those three seats, let us know in the comments of this video, and we'd be more than happy to put together a detailed comparison for those as well.
Before we move off of wash options, let's talk about the turbo wash and the enema wash or vortex wash. The turbo wash with the Econova is really just the one setting where the aerator kicks in. And that means that you get extra pressure with that particular wash. Now, most bidet seats have aerators and most bidet seats have those aerators kick in at the higher pressures. So the term turbo wash is a little bit of a meaningless term because almost all bidet seats have it. The BB2000 has an enema wash where there is a small hole as one of the spouts in the nozzle that the water comes out with extra pressure. Now, the term vortex means that there's a spin on that stream. However, we have disassembled the nozzle and taken micro photographs of the nozzle tip and have determined that in our opinion, there's nothing there that's going to give that nozzle any sort of spin when the water comes out of it. And so in our opinion, it is just a really strong, really narrow stream. While the wash is one of the most important features when it comes to a bidet's functionality, there are a lot of other features that both of these units have that make it a great option. Both of them have warm air dryers with adjustable temperature, but not adjustable pressure. The Eco Nova does not have a deodorizer built into it where the BB2000 does. Now it's important to note that a deodorizer does not add fragrance to the air. It actually removes the odor through an active carbon filter. The BB2000 does not have a sitable lid, whereas the Eco Nova does, and the suitable lid supports up to 400 pounds. Both of these seats support 400 pounds, but the lid of the Eco Nova supports 400 pounds, and the Eco Nova is made out of polypropylene plastic, whereas the BB2000 is made out of ABS plastic. The polypropylene plastic does tend to stand the test of time better and is a bit more flexible and less likely to break. We want to talk about more than just features because there's more to a bidet seat. So here are some things that we've discovered and our customers have reported to us that we think might be helpful to you. First of all, with the Eco Nova, we have a quick disconnect hose on the side. So instead of screwing the hose onto the bidet seat, you're actually going to slide the bidet seat and the hose together and use a clip to connect the two. You also are going to find that the installation instructions for the Eco Nova are pretty poor. So if you're looking at the installation instructions and struggling, watch our installation video, link is in the video description. And this installation video walks you through everything you could possibly need to know about installing it and will make a headache turn into a dream installation. It's also important to note that the battery insertion on the remote can be a little bit tricky. The large side needs to be facing outward and you need to give that battery a pretty good push in order for it to snap into place don't worry about breaking the snaps. You do have to give it a hard push in order for the battery to snap into place into the remote. While a lot of high-end bidet seats have night lights, the BB2000 takes a different approach than most. The Eco Nova has a light that lights up the bowl, whereas the BB2000 has a night light that lights up the outside portion of the seat. So it is a little bit different than what you're going to see with other night lights. The BB2000 also has one of the best water pressures on the market, but it doesn't have great water pressure range. So the range from low to high is pretty tight. This means that if you like good water pressure, the BB2000 is a fantastic option. But if you have a sensitive rear, the BB2000 might offer a water pressure that's gonna be uncomfortable even at the lowest setting. It's also important to note that the BB2000 is one of the only seats on the market that offers a belt-driven nozzle. So BioBidet says that this allows for the nozzle to be as accurate as possible when adjusting different positions. However, it can also be a detriment because it's one of the only seats that we run into where the nozzle can get stuck because the belt slides off of the gear mechanism. In a scenario like this, you'll see that the nozzle doesn't move and you'll hear a clicking or thumping sound in the back of the unit. In this scenario, you simply put it into self-cleaning mode. That's in the instructions. We also have a video on how to do that. And then give the nozzle a yank until the gears and the belt reconnect and go back into place. Another common question we get about the BB2000 is does the enema wash actually work? Yes, it does. Again, it's not something where you insert something into yourself. It is simply a strong pointed stream that works its way into your lower intestine. Now, one important thing to note, 
you do want to make sure you are properly lined up and properly relaxed before using the enema wash or you are going to find it very painful. Relax, aim, and use the enema wash and it will work. I personally have used it myself and we talk to a lot of customers who use it on a daily or weekly basis. A lot of our customers are trying a bidet seat for the first time. If you're in that boat, you may be concerned about what if I don't like one of these seats? Well, the good news is both of these seats are fantastic and they're so great that we offer a risk-free trial on either of them. So you're looking at a 30-day risk-free trial on the Econova and a 30-day risk-free trial on the BB2000. Don't love it? Within the first 30 days, return it for a full refund. You do have to pay return shipping, but we'll cover everything else. That will be all that you'll be out at the end of the day. So if you are concerned about whether or not you'll love one of these, but you wanna give it a try, jump on in, try one of them. Of course, if you have questions before you buy, reach out to us, we're happy to help as well. All of our contact information and website is in the video description. It's also important to note that these both come with a warranty. The BB2000 comes with a three-year full warranty, while the Econova comes with a two-year full warranty. So they both come with good warranties. They both should outlive their warranties. And again, we're always here to help. If you have questions or concerns, comment on this video so that we can address those questions and concerns and help others in the process. Thank you so much for watching. Visit our website, ask us about special pricing, and have a great day. Minibidets.com, where we sell mini bidets, not mini bidets.